Hello guys, this is Jerisa. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be DIYing three things for the outside of our front porch and I hope that you like this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe. Also, I'm going to list the link for the video that I made before this one where I decorated the inside of our house. Thank you so much for watching and let's get right into it. I wanted to show you this because I went on Pinterest and I found a bunch of ideas so I just kind of put them together to kind of get a vibe of what I wanted the front porch to look like. For the first DIY I'm going to make a wreath and everything I'm using is from the Dollar Tree. I wanted to make it affordable because you know that these things can be a little bit expensive. They have beautiful flowers and they also have little twinkle lights. So what I'm going to do is to kind of bend the flowers and then put them into the wreath and then I'm going to tape them off with a tape that I found there. It's actually not a tape, it's more like a ribbon but it actually works. You're just going to cover the whole thing with as many flowers as you want. I decided to go with these colors because it reminds me a lot of the movie Coco. I wanted to make it kid friendly because my daughter is three, so I just wanted her to look at this and be happy and feel a lot of vibrant colors and for her to be excited about it. And you're gonna see that she was helping me out along the process, which was really cool. I ended up using like 10 pieces, maybe 12 for each wreath besides the little pumpkins. And I feel like it's a good amount. If you wanna do more, it probably would look a little fuller too. The little pumpkin picks that I got, I really love how they look. I just took a pair of pliers. Better to cut these things like that because they have a little wire inside. To give you the final touch, I'm just going to add these little lights that I had. Oh, I got one in purple and one in orange, and I feel like they look so cute. Here you can see the front of our porch, and it's very gray and plain, so this is why I wanted to have a lot of color. <laughs> For the flower pots, I decided to go with fake flowers because I can reuse them as many times as I want. And also these flowers that I got are from Hobby Lobby. They were $8.99. Then they applied a 40% off and that was two days ago. I like the vibrant color that it has. And as you can see, my little helper was all over these things. She was helping me all the time. She loved it. <laughs> For this DIY, I was inspired by this little picture that I found on Pinterest. I just like the look of the little ghost. And I had this doormat that I bought like almost a year ago when we first moved into the house. I was going to spray paint it black, but I just wanted to get everything done as quick as possible. So I'm just going to use a little bit of paint and I'm going to paint little ghosts that, you know, like in cute shapes. And then I'm also going to add a couple little pumpkins and just a couple of details like that. If you have a doormat that you don't really use, you can just spray paint it black or any color that you want. And there is a bunch of ideas on Pinterest on things that you can do, like, you know, little pumpkins or little ghosts or bats, anything that you like, you can do with this. So the limit is your imagination. The other DIY that I'm going to do is with these pumpkins and I got these ones from Hobby Lobby. I got these ones because I live in Florida and it's super hot in here so everything goes bad if you put it outside like everything dies. And this is just an electric tape that I had here in the house and I'm just going to use this one to kind of make lines on the pumpkin and make it look like it has stripes like the rug that I have outside. And this is just a way to spice up your pumpkins without really ruining them or making a design that is going to be permanent. You can choose any color tape that you want. You can even put stickers on them. I think that would be a pretty cool look like putting stickers like color stickers on the pumpkins i've never seen anybody doing that let me know what you think about this in the comment section i really like this one now me and my little helper are going to decorate this wall with the bath she was having a blast because it's just fun to do this with somebody else and i just feel like it's a really good bonding experience for both of us and it's really cute to be able to look at this video and you know see her a little like that because in a couple of years <laughs> she's not even going to remember this but now i have the memory for it the last thing that I'm going to do is to decorate the ceiling on the entryway and I just love the look of these little hats just hanging there. I actually use little command strips. I cut them in half and I hang them from the ceiling. To be honest with you, I was very scared of this because the ceilings are very high and I almost broke my neck doing this. So <laughs> please give a like if you enjoy the video because this is everything that I had to show you for today. This is how everything turned out. I love the look. I'm probably gonna do more stuff, but for one day, it turned out great. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope that you enjoyed it. I'm going to list some more videos that I have over here so you can watch them. And yeah, let me know what you think about everything in the comment section. The other videos are going to be listed at the end. Thank you again and I will see you in the next time. Bye-bye.